Good day folks. Everything is smart in today's world. Smartphone, smart home, smart city and the world is envisaging a perfect smart car. What we have come up today is a smart way of testing V2X on the field. Assuming that you all know what V2X is, I am proceeding to the rest of the video. Testing V2X is a compression process. It involves renting of test tracks, deployment of roadside units, and cars for creating real-world conditions. Considering these factors, Tata LXE, which is a part of global conglomerate, the Tata Group, envisioned a product called as ARV2X, which is based on augmented reality. ARV2X is a groundbreaking product for OEMs and tier ones who wish to perform V2X testing on the roads. ARV2X will benefit the customers in terms of cost and time without compromising quality of testing. Air V2X can perform V2X testing in the field with minimalistic cost, precisely using a single car on the any given road with the help of Tata Alexis AI device. This device will create a virtual V2X ecosystem such as roadside units and neighboring cars for enabling the system testing of V2X ECU under test. The virtual roadside units and virtual cars can be seen through a tab or a hatchery placed in front of the driver using augmented reality. The alerts such as forward collision warning and speed limit warning can be seen in the infotainment screen. ARV2X supports 15 types of warnings and advisories. I am selecting a road somewhere in Chennai, India in which we are going to perform the V2X field testing. Point A to point B as you see in the screen. The blue line indicates the road which I have selected for testing. In the same road, I am placing a virtual car at an offset of 200 meters. I am placing a hazardous location roadside unit in the road at a distance of 1 km. I am placing another roadside unit which is a speed limit warning at a distance of 2 km in the same road. This is the car in which we are going to perform with 2 x field testing. This is V2X ECU under test which has already been integrated with the car. We have an infotainment screen for displaying alerts and warnings. We have a shark fin antenna as well. This is Tata Alexis Air V2X device. We have a user interface for configuring Air V2X on the go. And we have a tablet for projecting ER generated cars and deployments. Based on the configuration which we did earlier, there is a single virtual car and two roadside deployments along the route which we are going to perform V2X field testing. We shall see the corresponding AR generated images and alerts once we go near these deployments. Like you see in the map, we have a car in the front and when we approach the car, you will see AR generated image in the tablet. Here is the AR generated image. and corresponding warnings in the infotainment screen. The alerts would disappear once we cross the virtual car. We are now approaching a speed limit zone of 20 km per hour. You will see a speed limit sign in the tablet and the corresponding alert in the infotainment screen. The alert would disappear once we cross the speed limit zone. Like you can see the map UA, we are out of speed limit zone and approaching towards hazardous location zone. We are at hazardous location zone now. Here is a alert in the infotainment screen. 
and corresponding image in the tablet. ARV 2X comes with an option for debugging. It can be done on the go or in a lab using the recorded filters video and the corresponding packets which was captured at any given time step. Thus, it is quite easy to convert any normal road into a field test track using ARV2X. For knowing more about ARV2X, please drop an email to info at tatalexi.co.in.